guys welcome back to another video from Andrew Beast. so today's video is going to be very interesting one because in this video I am going to show you the full tutorial on how to play GTA 4 on any Android device especially for all Mali chipset devices like if you have MediaTek Helio G series device like G80, G85, G95, G99 or MediaTek Diamond series series chipset device or even Samsung Exynos devices after this video you guys can also enjoy GTA 4 on your Android device with smooth playable FPS and also to let you know guys this method will also work with the Snapdragon chipsets so without any further delay let's begin with the video First of all, let's discuss about the things that we are going to need in order to run GTA 4 on our Android device. So the first thing is obviously the game. The second thing is the emulator on which we are going to run GTA 4. So here we are going to use Exagear X11 emulator in order to run GTA 4 on our Android device. The third thing is the OBB file which we will uh, install after the installation of X11 APK. The fourth thing is the input bridge. Uh, which we are going to use in order to play games using on-screen touch controller. So let's begin with the first step. Just install the Exagate X11 APK. Simply click on install. That's it. Now install the Input Bridge app. Now after uh, these things are installed, just go to Exagate app. Give the storage permission and select the obb file from your file manager now after you have selected that file just wait for a few seconds until it is installed inside our x11 app ok so after it is successfully installed now it's time to set up our emulator so let's begin the step 2 of this video that is setting up the emulator for that simply go to manage containers click on this download icon click on downloadables and just click on refresh wait for three to four seconds and you will see a huge list of uh, various wine version will shown up uh, from those version just move to the bottom end and, and choose the last one that is wine 5.5 and click on download now wait until it is uh, it's getting downloaded okay after that just click ok now move to this uh, option called as local and click this uh, setting icon click on install and wait for it to get installed 200 percent okay so now it is installed now just click ok now go to manage containers once again now click here this plus icon and you will see our wine 5.5 will be added inside our manage container list now here go to setting icon once again go to configuration and do a simple configuration that is change the gpu renderer to virtual built-in mesa 23 uh, 3.2.0 change the screen size to 800 by 600 now just scroll down and click controls and select uh, this one hybrid okay now just untick this one that is hide start menu if run from shortcut option now go to desktop shortcut and you will see that a folder named tfm will show up just uh, move inside that folder and you will see uh, three things okay now before launching the emulator simply uh, click on this setting icon click on virtual overlay and give the overlay permission to our Exagear X11. Press back and just uh, check these uh, boxes until the end. Now scroll down, click on start service, click OK. Now just uh, simply click on the middle, uh, middle one and you will see that our emulator will start. Now still a lot of work is left before launching GTA 4. So just go to start menu, click on install, click on DirectX, click on installer and wait for it to get installed. Now again go to start, click install, click on Mesa and just install the second last one that is 23.0.0. Now again go to start, go to register option, 
go to the first option csmt and simply click here that's it our emulator all the settings is now successfully done now uh, let's set up the output bridge app okay so for that simply minimize open input bridge app just give the permission of overlay now here just click on import and simply just import the gto4 touch controller now it is successfully imported just go to this option and just tick one this one so control when connected option that's it simply minimize open x again x11 one second click here go to setting click on virtual overlay and start service do this step every time before launching the emulator okay now you will face problem in running games now simply click here to open the emulator now here inside uh, our file manager you will see a folder called input bridge okay now go to installer go uh, now click install dot batch now press any key click ib.x so now you will see that in the top right corner a setting icon has popped up on clicking on that icon you will see our on screen touch controller will show up and you can use this touch controller in order to play games like gta 4 even you can play other games also so simply just hide this button now let's start our gta 4 and let's see how it's running now before launching gta 4 you have to uh, do a very simple step in order to run gta 4 without without infinite loading screen glitch right so for that just click start go to the first option app do systema click on tax manager go to processes and inside the process list you will see one process called tfm.x simply uh, tap and hold on that process now click say affinity now just tick this first one cpu 0 and untick all the cpus from cpu 4 to cpu 7 click ok now just touch and hold gta 4.exe click open quickly come to tax manager quickly just tap on it click set affinity just untick the first one and tick from 4 to 7 and you have to do this uh, do the following step very quickly now what will happen is the, your game will stuck into infinite glitch mode okay okay so as you can see our game is now running successfully Latin testosterone energy drink. Live life to the limit. Thinking about it. I'm drunk. Film of the year. Princess robot bubble gun. Poorly dubbed in English from the Japanese. Now we make a love like a crush can. Princess robot bubble gun and the horny radioactive plant in 20. Why don't you show me around the city? Fucking terrorist! What? Terrorist! There's been a beach scare and you can't go across the bridges so good. You without the visa. I would stay in broker. Fucking stay in Hove Beach. Everyone like us does. 